Hey y'all, this is Owen and the Diva. Just letting you know, um, just coming at you guys and some things I said I was gonna talk to you about that's on my mind. Let me take me my love, my knit first. Got things to do. Mm. See, this shows you I'm so much of a diva. My flask is even bling blinged out. Yeah, I bling bling out with my flask, honey. And my drink is um vodka, not Syrah, that little cutesy stuff, because it do not do nothing for you. Okay, give me some goose or something, get you on a nice bent, and I'll be all good. Just a second. Mm. Whew. Anyway, back to the story in hand. Get this little hair, you know, got to have my other wig for the day, you know what I mean? Again, face made up today. And whenever I have a little time to myself, idle time, and things be on my mind, I just want to kind of, um, do a video. Hit you up. What's on my mind? Um, my thoughts today is dating in Atlanta. I've been in Atlanta for seven years. I moved here. I moved here because of my son and music and other personal reasons and, and all that. Uh, freshly I got divorced. That's going to be a whole nother story. I'll tell you another day. But um, one thing I noticed about here in Atlanta, these niggas here is something different. And I can't say they all truly Atlanta niggas. Excuse me. It's because um, a lot of them are from different places and different states and different everywhere. But I tell you, when you move here, you don't really know anybody per se. And you might learn a couple of people. But my whole thing is, that's when you end up start dating off of the dating website. I've been done a couple of dating websites. And man, I tell you what. When I tell you niggas be lying. I ask you if you how tall you are. If I say you five, are you taller than five five? Nigga tell my yeah. Um, see, I'm five seven. I ask niggas, well, how tall are you? Oh, I'm five seven. You come see them, that niggas is five two. You know I'm pissed. You come see the nigga, man, if you gay, I ain't getting up. You gay. But nigga, don't be gay and trying to talk to damn me. I don't want no gay nigga. I want a straight nigga. Okay? Not a gay nigga. Not a bisexual nigga. Let's put that up front. I want a straight nigga. And I'm not. I know pimping ain't easy out here. But nigga. 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 I ain't taking care of no damn grown ass man no niggas so i'm gonna let you know right there don't come to me with that shit niggas swear oh i just got here then you meet them they ain't got no damn car <sighs> barely got a damn job ain't got nowhere damn to stay they invite you out on a damn date and soon as you sit down there eat your food good out oh, um you get paid for your own food I'm like, what the fuck i got paid for my own food you asked me out on a date i ain't never heard of such so what happens one nigga, he told me that. He said, I'm going to the bathroom. All right. He went to the bathroom. I paid the waitress for my food. And I hurry up and I ran, went on out the door. The nigga come looking for me. I was pulling out the parking lot. He running looking for me. Pulling out, I'm pulling out the parking lot. Nigga. Bitch, where? Okay. Where do they do that at? He had me mixed up. Then I had the nerve to go out with another one. Do the same shit. And then got the nerve to my, oh, you my type. You Thick. You pretty trying to touch me. I said, nigga, don't you touch me. I don't know you. And then you ain't pay for my shit. You, I, as soon as I sit down here and I get me a drink uh, and something to eat, you going to tell me I get paid for my own stuff? I'm like, uh, and then constantly, come on. Hey. And then you got the nerve to say, the nigga had the nerve to say he is in the process of divorce. You should have told me that in the beginning. But y'all still living in the same house and sleeping in the same damn bed. I said, well, ain't that bitch. Where are they do? Where? Bitch, where? Nigga, really? Man, these niggas here in Atlanta, they had some crazy ones. Ask them a question. Just one question. They going off cussing you out. Don't be asking me out that quick. I'm like, what the? F I'm like, they get medication for that. Are you taking it? Honey, I'm telling you, you will want to be where? Okay? I'm I have ran into, I mean... It ain't like how you get, you know, women be trying to find them a man to take care of them. And I ain't really trying to do, I can take care of my own dang self. But, hey, nigga, I ain't cheap. You, it, it ain't free. But these niggas out here, they think they cute. 
And these hoes are so thirsty. They want them niggas so bad. So they come in and they expect you to take care of them. They, oh shoot, they the woman. You the nigga. They want you to take care of them. I said, huh, T, this is some new stuff on me. A new day or these little hoes done get the game twisted for the other hoes, for the original hoes. Because I don't do that. Okay? Bitch, where? I don't do that. And I'm like, nigga, you want to want a dying piece, but you want to pay two cents and a dead fly for it. Nigga, you ain't getting me like that. No. That ain't where it is. You think you have cute and think you're gonna, just going to come and live off of me. Fronting like you doing this and doing that and like you that nigga. And you ain't doing nothing. Ain't got a place to stay. Staying with your mama better your mama than your wife. Because these married men is out of control down here. Something wrong with you. They act like something wrong with you. Or you got a disease mentally in your head because you won't talk to them. Okay. I, hey, all I know is anybody moving down here to a, to the L. I mean, I said the L. I mean to the A, not the L. A-T-L. And you expect to, um, honey. And like I said, all these little niggas be... On the sly, sleeping with other niggas, don't want to tell you. Nigga, keep it real. You want a man? Get you a man. Leave me be. Okay? Leave a sister like me be. I'm just saying. So, you ladies, beware. Wear your condoms. Your husband's is doing every damn thing with everybody. These women swear, my man ain't. He ain't. Girl, your husband is doing it with everybody. Uh, yes. Okay? I, pro I know I probably met a woman of them. No, but I don't do that no more. So don't get mad at me. Don't judge me. I don't do that no more. And if you do it, ladies, don't. Don't do it no more. Let that nigga go on. But they so damn persistent. And they the ones who want to give you money and want this and this and that. They want to take care of you and the single niggas don't want to give you nothing. So try to fight that temptation. Don't, don't meddle with them. Okay, remember me. That's gonna be another whole another story. I'm gonna tell you another day. But I just want to let y'all know how it is in Atlanta dating, keeping it real. And I don't care how cute you are, you ugly or a. Hey, these brothers is off the hook. Okay, so ladies, good luck. All right, this is uh Zoe and the Fashion Diva. Let me get another sip because I got stuff to do. And uh, hmm. I like to kind of feel good while I'm doing it. Woo! All right. Talk to you next time, baby. All right. Peace out.